breaking al-Qaeda demand jihadis attack U.S. and U.K. for Trump act of blatant aggression. According to U.S.-based site monitoring website, the terror group is calling on its supporters to carry out attacks on the U.S. and its allies in response to the move by the Republican firebrand. In a statement, the Islamist militant group said Trump's decision was a result of normalization steps between some Gulf Arab countries and Israel. The group added, it is also a clear challenge to the Muslim world that sees the centrality of the Palestinian cause. In the face of this serious events, we stand by our people in Palestine and support them with all we possess. If you do not move, God forbid, then tomorrow the holiest of places and the Muslims' Qibla, Mecca, will be sold and you will find then no one to defend it. Al-Qaeda then called on Muslims with money and weapons to help and asked Islamist militants to be ready to support Palestinians. The branch of the terror group that made the statement, AKIP, was formed in 2009 when Al-Qaeda's Saudi Arabia and Yemen groups came together. The U.S. has previously carried out a number of drone strikes on the group that has targeted its leaders. In 2011 a drone strike ordered by Barack Obama killed Anwar al-Awlaki a well-known figure in the group who was known to convert people to its ideology. Trump announced on Wednesday he believes it is time to officially recognize Jerusalem as the capital of Israel. The decision unraveled years of work to establish peace in the Middle East and sparked warnings from Hamas about possible uprisings against Israel. Spontaneous protests broke out in the region following the move and despite the deployment of thousands of Israeli troops. There are few signs that tensions will subside quickly. The Islamist group said Trump had opened the gates of hell with his flagrant aggression while Turkey strongly condemned the move. More to follow.